everybody, my name is Becca and I'm with the Glacier Institute. Today I'm going to be showing you how to make a homemade magnifying glass. Looks something like this. Super simple, super easy. You can use it. We're going to have some really cool activities for you later on that this will be super helpful if you don't have your own magnifying glass. Or if you're just hanging out outside, it's always awesome to explore your world on a smaller scale. So all you're going to need for this is a piece of old cardboard, a shoe box, works really well. Then something clear and see-through. So we have some old saran wrap laying around, so that's what we're gonna use, but you could use an old Ziploc baggie. As long as it's clear and you can see through it, it'll work. You'll need some tape, duct tape, packing tape, whatever tape you have laying around works as well. Some scissors are really helpful, and the last thing you're gonna need is just a little bit of water. So let's get going here. So first thing you're gonna do is you're gonna take your old piece of cardboard and you're gonna cut it into a smaller square. Just like this, all right? And then this is probably the hardest step. You need to cut a circle in the center of your square. So the easiest way to do that is to fold your cardboard in half. And kind of like when you were in elementary school, you're gonna cut a half circle into your cardboard just like you were making a snowflake. Just be really careful. Don't cut yourself. It doesn't have to be perfect. Just do your best, okay? And then, you just unfold it and something that resembles a circle will have been cut out. Okay, the next thing you gotta do is you're gonna cover this circle with your clear see-through plastic. So we're gonna take our little piece of cling wrap, we're gonna place it over the circle, grab our tape, and we're gonna tape down all of the edges. And we want it to be pretty tight. So I'm gonna tape down this first edge here. Then go to the opposite side. Find the edge of the cling wrap right there. And I'm gonna pull it kind of tight and I'm gonna tape it in place. Okay. And I'm gonna do the same thing on the other side. Find the edge, pull it tight, tape it down. Find the edge, pull it tight and tape it down. Okay, perfect. So now that we have our piece of cardboard with a hole in the middle, with something clear and plastic over that hole, the last step is just to fold two sides of your new magnifying glass in so that we kind of create a mini table. And we're just trying to raise our magnifying glass up off the surface a little bit. So try and make both sides even. You don't have to fold a bunch. A little bit is just fine. And then you're gonna flip it over and it should stand on its own like that. So then the last step, just to make your magnifying glass magnify, is you're gonna find something that you wanna magnify. We're gonna use this really awesome furred pamphlet. We're gonna choose our mountain bluebird. So we're gonna put our magnifying glass over what we wanna magnify. And then you just need to take a little bit of water and dab that onto the center. And voila, you can magnify anything. You can magnify words, you can magnify pictures. Maybe you're out exploring outside and you find a really cool feather you wanna magnify. You can just kind of put it over that, move it around. It gives you just a little bit more of a close-up image of the world. So I hope this was super helpful, super fun. Stay tuned for later. We're gonna have some awesome activities to share with you guys. Get out there and explore.